G'day, welcome to the next um, video on finger patterns. So we've done the left hand. Um, we're going to just do a couple of right hand ones now. I've already got the document up here on my PDF. Um, but of course, if, if you're wondering where to, to find these documents, have a look in the left hand video. Um, here we are, we've got the right hand patterns. And just like with the left hand, we have about seven patterns. But all of these patterns are used for the 12 different major scales. So many of these patterns double up, um, as you can see. Um, so for example, here's B major and E major, it uses the same set of four notes in the right hand. Uh, when you combine those with different patterns in the left hand, you get these various scales. So let's start off in the middle, as is always the best spot, spot to start. So once again, we're listening for evenness of tone and we're listening for the even finger movements. And we're also feeling our fingers, just seeing if they're nice and relaxed, making sure we're aware of any tension and, and working to eliminate any sort of tension that, that we become aware of. So this is our C major pattern, also the same pattern that we use in F major on our right hand. hand there D E F G and we're just slowly going backwards and forwards getting it nice and even to start with descending ascending start to branch out we'll start to to vary it up a little bit so if we let's go the direction of the flats so B flat major E flat major use this pattern here um, pretty much the same except for one little difference we use that E flat you can see it there E flat <laughs> slowly start even and gradually work your speed up keep the tone level keep listening keep feeling um, it's a great warm-up if you get seven of these under your fingers when it comes to scales the world's your oyster you'll um your fingers will know what to do so enjoy spend a little bit of time on this each day and i promise you you'll start to see results in your, your fluency cheers guys <laughs>